We lost a lot of shingles off of that roof last night. My arms aren't long enough. We're sitting on a pile of hay. So yeah, so snow was not in the weather forecast. And then it said it was going to end at one o'clock, but now it's 3.30 and it's still snowing. So, and the sheep, here come the sheep. It's interesting. They were, they were over there, but then I came over here and opened up this bale a little bit. I, I dropped this bale here earlier today. My tractor is finally fixed and now it has a flat tire in the front. <laughs> But I got I got some bales put out here. And here come the sheep. What? That was my spiky. Come here. Yeah, here come the sheep. Zoom in on them here. They're like, oh, the dogs are there. We don't necessarily want to hang out with the dogs and the human. We like the human. But these dogs, we don't know. They're not part of our flock, but we tolerate them. Luna baby, what are you doing, honey? Luna's right here. She's always looking for something. Luna baby, come here, honey. Come, come cuddle. Come cuddle. You be good. You be nice. There you go. Just chill. There you go. Chill. Chillax. What? What? The rest of the sheep are just standing there going, Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm sort of hungry, but that guy is scary, and the dogs are scary, and I don't know if that hay's any good anyway. It's a very nice pastoral scene. I'm gonna take a picture, here we go. Hey, Looney. How's my girlfriend? Be nice. What are you doing? Looney just climbed up to the top. What are you doing, honey? Hey, hey, what are you doing? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yes, yes, you climbed on top of the hay bale. Come on, cuddle with us. Yeah, me and Spike are cuddling. You want to cuddle with us? Yeah, yeah, yes. Spike's like, I can look at you. My hands are getting cold holding the phone. Come on, come on right down here. Come on, snuggle up with us. Nope, she's not gonna. All right. It takes so little to make this one happy. He just, he doesn't mind where you rub him as long as you just touch him somewhere. He doesn't want food, he wants love. My love puppy. Well, <coughs> speaking of love, <coughs> I am loving recording in my new garage studio. The garage is not new, the studio is new. And uh, <coughs> set up. And I recorded three songs this week, and one of them is called Walk Through Roses. And Walk Through Roses is all about this idea that we get what we focus on. We get what we focus on. So I want to play that song for you, and then I have some thoughts about that. And it's raining right now. Corey and I are supposed to move the cows later today from where from his place over to his mom's place. And I don't know if we'll actually end up doing that or not, but it's pouring rain right now. We've had snow, we've had wind, we've had rain, we've had snow, we've had wind, we've had rain, we've had snow, we've had wind, we've had rain this week. And uh, supposedly we're getting another one coming in today or tomorrow, uh, tomorrow being Sunday. So I'm thinking about the Sunday message, thinking about the week, 
And I took a wonderfully blissful Sunday off last week and I didn't do a Sunday message and there was a snowstorm down in Albany, New York. So Unity Church canceled their stuff. So I guess I needed a break. I didn't realize I needed a break, but I needed a break. But the thing is, it's all about what we focus on in our lives. Our lives will reflect the dominant thoughts of our mind. And we all have negative thoughts. The challenge is to catch ourselves when we're stuck in negative thought patterns, to interrupt the pattern, and to get back to focusing on what we desire. And this is not about shallow stuff. This is about what what's your heart's desire. You know, not, do you want to make more money this year? What do you want the money for, right? Do you want a, a, a relationship? What do you want the relationship for? It's, you know, we want to focus on the things that bring us light, that bring us love, that bring us more harmony, that bring us more joy, and no one's against that, right? So anyway, let me sing the song for you, and then I'll break it down afterwards, all right? So hang with me, stay to the end, because there's, we're giving away prizes. No, just kidding, here's the song. <laughs> blossoms in spite of what you've torn Can you catch a glimpse of heaven in a drop of dew or your reflection in Focusing on what you want Focusing on me Focusing my love on you Focusing on me Focusing my love If you cried a river Would it feel much better than If you laughed the ocean And chose to dive right in When you hear a jazz band Do you hear the bass or the horns And if somebody asked you Could you tell them why You were born We get what we focus on So focusing on what you want Focusing on me, focusing my love on you Focusing on me, focusing my love
feel constrained Or would you feel connected And choose freely to remain If I then released you And then danced away Would you choose to feel abandoned Or would you see it as a chance to play We get what we focus on so Focusing on what you want Focusing on me Focusing my love on you We get what we focus on So focusing on what you want Focusing now, me focusing my love on you. Focusing now, me focusing my love. So the idea that we get what we focus on, it's not new. It's not a new idea. Proverbs back in the Old Testament says, as a man thinketh, so is he. What's really going on in your thoughts, in your heart, is what actually determines who you are. But in every other situation, we get what we focus on. Elon Musk focused very early on on electric cars, right? Now he's focused on other stuff, right? And the truth comes out when we look at our lives and we look at the hopes and dreams that we had that led us step by step from one thing to the other, led us to introduce ourselves to this person or to meet that person or to think about something that perhaps we hadn't considered before. And step by step, minute by minute, motion by motion, decision by decision, we create our lives. We get what we focus on. So focus in on what you want. Anxiety is focusing on what you don't want. Anxiety is thinking about what you do not want to have happen. And I talk about this quite a bit because I spent about 20 years working as a hypnotherapist with people who had anxiety. And I was one of those people that I worked with. <laughs> and I realized that anxiety is not a disease. Anxiety is the result of focusing on what you do not want. So the, the solution to anxiety is instead of focusing on what you do not want, focus on it enough to take preventative action, like, I don't want to be cold in the winter, so I have a house, I have clothing, I have, a, I have gear, right? Anxiety leads us to solutions, but we can't stay stuck in anxiety. We have to move from what we don't want. Okay, that's what I don't want. What do I want and how can I create what I do want? How can I create what I do want? For probably 25 years, I've imagined recording in this garage. Uh, this garage is a three-car garage. And it was packed at one point full of waste vegetable oil that my father went around to all the fast food restaurants and collected because he was going to make biodiesel. 
And I did prevail upon him at one point. I was like, Dad, the garage is a bomb. Like, you have so much flammable stuff out here. Right? <laughs> and, and I imagine the garage being clear. <laughs> I imagine the garage being a place where music could be made and a large enough space so I could have other musicians join me. And uh, let me just take it to the window here. It's not the best. It's not a clean window. But the garage has windows on three sides. And I have been holding in my mind for a long time the idea of, of being out here. The idea of having actually more room to to do my music. And, and last week it happened. And this week, in the midst of wind storms and losing power for 12 hours and snow and then rain and snow and rain and snow and rain, I focused on recording my music. And I focused on getting my tractor fixed. And I focused on taking care of the animals. And I focused on spending quality time with Spike and Luna, the livestock guardian dogs, right? And in the process, time goes by. How are you spending your time? Are you doing what you really wanna do? Are you being who you really wanna be? The solution it's going to take a while, but the solution, stick to, watch to the end to find it all revealed. I'll reveal it right now. The solution to you becoming who you truly long to be is to focus on who it is you long to be. The solution to doing what you want to do in life for a career or whatever it is that you want to be doing is to focus on what you want to be doing, not focusing on what you don't want to be doing. If you don't want to be doing it, why are you doing it? You have one life. Maybe we have other lives. Who knows? I don't know for a fact, but I do know I have this life and I have my health and I have abilities that I want to use to make a positive difference in the world without coming from my ego. I want to come from my heart and to share this music and to share this idea of a farm church with anybody who is willing and open to joining me on a journey towards thriving, on a journey towards peace, on a journey towards health, on a journey towards lasting abundance and wealth, on a journey towards healing the planet on a journey towards healthy food, on a journey towards spirituality that is inclusive and transformational. That's what I'm focusing on. Focus in on what you want. Focus in on me focusing my love on you. How would that feel? If I wrapped my arms around you, would you feel constrained or would you feel connected and choose freely to remain? If I then released you and then danced away, would you feel abandoned? Or would you see it as a chance to play? This week, take a chance to play. Focus in on what you want. Focus on what you want. Peace, love. Grooviness, sending out prayers. Amen. So the day after a storm, there's almost always light. <laughs> and I try to remind myself Every time I go through a personal storm, that on the other side of the storm is light. And uh, so we had a nice snowstorm here in Albany, New York. All the Unity Church services were canceled. So I actually had a day off. And I'm just 
so grateful for it because I'm all charged up. I'm all excited. I'm all ready to get going for the new year. And uh, so a lot of cool stuff is about to happen. And I just had to capture this moment of light. And I'm holding the phone between me and the sun because otherwise I can't even see it so bright. <laughs> the day after the storm, people. Enjoy it, and just remember, the next storm you're in, it's all temporary, and the sun is coming. All right? Peace, love, and grooviness. Over and out. Boom. It is now Sunday morning. I think it's the 14th of January, 2024, and uh, it's snowing again. <laughs> we had rain yesterday. Then the temperature dropped rapidly, and um, yeah. So... Anyway, I thought it'd be cool, even though I played the song for you already, I thought it would be cool to take some of the footage from Monday. Ursula and I went for a, a lovely hike on a very beautiful lookout spot overlooking the Catskill Mountains from Columbia County. And I thought it would be really cool to just play the song again for you using that uh, moment, those visuals of the sun going down through the clouds in the direction of the mountains. I thought that would be a cool way to end. So just, if you have a minute, just take a minute with me and just kind of go into a meditative state. You know, hopefully you're listening in headphones. Hopefully you have a moment. It's like a four or five minute song. So just listen to it again and see where it takes you, all right? And thank you very much as always for your support, your encouragement, and again, these songs are prayers that I send out into the world and hopefully they wrap around your heart in a positive way, in a positive, hopeful, transformational, impactful, loving way, because that's the intention that I'm sending them out with. Peace, love, and grieviness. Just enjoy the song. Okay, thanks. Peace. blossoms in spite of what you've torn Can you catch a glimpse of heaven in a drop of dew or your reflection in We get what we focus on, so focus in on what you want. Focus in on me, focusing my love on you. Focus in on me, focusing my love. If you cried a river Would it feel much better than If you laughed the ocean And chose to dive right in When you hear a jazz band Do you hear the bass or the horns And if somebody asked you Could you tell them why You were born We get what we focus on So 
focus in on what you want Focus in on me Focusing my love on you Focus in on me Focusing my love To feel connected and choose freely to remain. If I then released you and then danced away, would you choose to feel abandoned or would you see it? Focusing on what you want Focusing on me Focusing my love on you We get what we focus on So focusing on what you want Focusing now on me, focusing my love on you Focusing on me, focusing my love